He's a disabler and a ganker. <laughs> He's a disabler and a ganker. <laughs> it's written right there. Of course, a hybrid and medium difficulty. So, you know, check him out. I just showed him off. Now you can check him out. Now that he's been shown off. What is ganking? <laughs> Thank you. All you have to do is immobilize him. And then he doesn't have the ability to chase you anymore. And that's when you could beat his ass. Wait a minute. Oh! Well, what else do you think? What's next? 3-3 three, three is a bomb? This? No shit, genius. <laughs> this is a bomb? That's your advice? Huh? <laughs> Thank you. Doesn't it look like Kazuya, like a fly landed right on his nose? And he's giving that fly like a dirty look right on the bridge of his brow. There's a fly on there. And he's pissed. <laughs> Somebody get this fly off my face, damn it. Okay, Mello. Yuka. <laughs> yeah, I'm a big Yuka. <laughs> I'm a big Yuka. Uh, what? <laughs> Who's my opponent? You know, I didn't have access to the titty slider, but my default titties are pretty fucking big, so it's pretty good still. I mean, they don't need to get much bigger than that. Right? Damn, my hands are fucking... Alright, they could be bigger. If you got hands that big, catcher's mitts, maybe they could be a little bigger. God damn, what did I do? I got Donkey Kong hands. My God! No! Fuck! 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 It's really hard to top Tekken Seven. Uh, <laughs> you could top that shit. Trust me, it's not that Tekken Seven. Look, let's, come on man, Tekken 7 got so fucking lucky that Street Fighter 5 was trash, dude. If Street Fighter 5 was good, Tekken 7 was fucked, okay? It sucked, and everyone looked over at Tekken, and everyone thought, hey, this is pretty cool, people seem to like it, it got attention, that shit was a big factor, dude. When it launched, big time. People really wanted Tekken 7. Uh, oh my god. Mexican Akuma, dude. That was he's he's making orange chicken. That was the most Mexican Akuma thing I've seen in Tekken ever. That was a Mexican Akuma technique right there. Orange chicken coming right up, dude. Break time's over. Break time's over. I'm gonna start teleporting. I gotta get back to work. That's Mexican Akuma right there. That was insane. Yes, you fucking scrub! Oh, I mean, uh, good games, good games, good games, amigo. He's top from that region. Oh, really? All right, cool. Is he gonna come back? Nah, I don't think so. He could. It's like one big mistake. Well, not even that big, man. She a hoe. It's like two buttons. Oh, thanks, guys. Hey, DDR Muchacho, thanks, thanks, Death Cradle, this motherfucker. You got it. Death Cradle, this motherfucker. Oh my god. Well, it's break time. You can't grab him. He's okay. Okay, action points replenished. And it's on, 95%. Fuck this guy. Oh, wow. Okay! Oh! Oh, I'm ch- I'm chasing him. This is my favorite game. 
That was two home runs with the chase down with a fucking mysterious stranger finish, dude. This game is so sick. What is this thing? Yeah, that's Mathis. How old is this guy? He looks young, but he could be like 40. He looks like he could be anywhere from 21 to 40. <laughs> His legs are crossed pretty tight. Damn, this guy in the middle's got the wide. Hey, what's that dude's name? Phil Spencer? The guy in the middle's got the wide Phil Spencer stance. And Mathel's got the tight, thank you, tight cross. You guys did good. We had a few laughs. We made fun of a few, few people, few people. We made fun of that kid for getting his back blown out. That guy got his ass kicked so fast, dude. And he's only 16. So we're like all dicks. We're all like 40-year-old bitches making fun of a 16-year-old. And that's awesome. Get on, you little bitch. <laughs> Get fucking on. Nice mustache. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking 40 making fun of a middle school kid. <laughs> that is tight. I wish I could go back and, like, I wish I could see into the future and see what a wonderful adult I've become. Here's another example. I could definitely get a hair transplant and get a full head of hair, okay? And I mean the luscious. Okay, that'll be cheaper than the money I'm gonna spend on this fucking car, right? But, what if that shit ruins my build? My luck build could go down the toilet if I get new hair. What if my hairline is lucky? You ever think about that? On the topic of being handsome? Uh, thank God that chicks like personalities. Holy shit, pretty girls like a good personality if that wasn't the case man i would be fucked holy cow i would be fucked but thankfully you know chicks like personalities so you could pull through someone in the chat called this let me find it <laughs> someone in the chat called this the slushy straw solo <laughs> okay, action. I think that it feels too much like Tekken 7 and the parts of it that are new are so unfinished and unbalanced and broken and they don't even make sense in some cases. The, you know, it's just hard to even critique it in a positive way when it's incomplete the new stuff so it's very hard to even have a real opinion about this game it just feels too much like tekken 7 to me yes ah man that is satisfying you stupid bitch ah i mean ah fuck uh you um mm. Amigo? Yeah, okay, even if you do get water from food, bringing it up in an environment like this, during a conversation like this, is guaranteed to get you called fat, is what I'm talking about. Do you understand? This is more of why you shouldn't say it. Whether or not it's true is irrelevant. It makes you sound fat as fuck. <laughs> You see, <clears throat> how much water do you get out of gravy, <laughs> amigo? How much water is that? So if we're gonna convert that one gallon a day of water, so how much? How many gallons of gravy do you have to drink to then not have to drink any water at all? You know, now you're thinking we don't have to drink water; we can eat it. Ah, was that it? Was that it? No? Okay, signature right now. Left, left, no, how do you do it? Left, 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 is this the signature? <laughs> what the fuck was that? Oh! 
No! No! I started a, a SST Gladiator, and I had more fun in the first four acts of PoE playing Solo Cell Found than I did in the last 50 hours playing Diablo 4. Just letting you know. And I'm not even fucking kidding about that shit, dude. There are so many cases of genuine dopamine that you get, even in that game's campaign, that there is no, there's no sign of that in Diablo 4. There, Diablo 4 has a forced and limited progression curve. You can't find anything that will be a jackpot in Diablo 4. There are no jackpots in that game, ever. It's so weird. Thank you very much. Two minutes! D4 bad. What did he just say at the end? <laughs> oh! D4 bad? We have to move also safely because if we move too fast, we can kind of vibrate the game out of stability. And so we're trying to. Vibrate the game out of stability. But in a safe way. Dude, I gotta write that down. <laughs> we can't work too fast. I gotta write that one down. That's that's gold right there. We can't work too fast, or we will vibrate the game out of stability. Holy shit, dude, that's good. This guy's good. We don't want to work too fast now. Okay. Clean. I don't even have mouth herpes. You know how many people have mouth herpes? The odds of that is like one in five. Did you know that? It's so common. Yeah, I do have gout, but that's not a sexually transmitted disease unless you like pepperonis as much as I do. Then it's kind of like a sexually transmitted disease, which I I got. <laughs> now see how you like this. Ah, broke the other thing too. Now I'm gonna go bounce off the- Oh! Alright, I forgot. I forgot that the ropes- You couldn't bounce off them. I was gonna bounce off the rope. Alright, don't bounce off the- <laughs> You said you were done last round? Would you shut the fuck up, dude? You, that is the number one reason why I'll never have kids. Because kids are the kinds of little bitches that say shit like, But you said- I'm Darth Vader, dude. I've altered the deal, okay? If I were you, orange name, I would pray I don't alter it further. All right, bitch? Stupid kid question. But you said... Anyway, uh, I hope you're doing well. Happy 4th of July. I only chat once a month, trying to make other chatters laugh. Frowny face. Go fuck yourself. Denied. Um... Let's see. Sorry denied uh, let's see here this guy said ban me and then he got banned I would like to see the chat again denied uh, why did I get banned yesterday unbanned please denied uh, you think let's see what we got here unbanned me my first and last offense he's right about that denied it's hard to believe that someone could fall for that thank you and at the same time be a real fan like how do you think that i would give lessons on how to be a better streamer and why would you want lessons from me on how to be a better streamer i do everything ass backwards i permanently ban and i'm extremely rude to everyone in here who's new i want no new fans I play the same games from the early 90s over and over and over again and ban anyone who mentions anything about it. <laughs> you want strategies from... I stream in 720p. My camera's green. I mean, the list is endless. Do I need to do this shit? Here, let me do this shit a little Lightning. bit. Lightning! Lightning! You want advice from me? Enough! Enough! That was sick. Oh, let's see. <laughs> but my everyday work lol 
anyone who tries to tell you that shit's work is a bitch. Right now, doing a sponsored stream, that counts as work because I'm doing something for someone, you know? But just streaming every day just for fun and then making a living off of it, tell, go outside and talk to the guy wearing a fucking orange stupid looking outfit and a hard hat who's jacking the fuck out of the floor in a hundred degrees. This guy's jacking, his joints are fucked up. He's getting dirty under the sun. Tell that guy that it's a job. When you're sitting here fucking chilling with your shoes off wondering how hot it is, that's a job. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that guy. I don't know if he's been the law of America. That guy's got an heiress tattoo. <laughs> what? Be jealous. Uh, I'm not allowed to say anything about it. Uh, yes, exactly. All right. Well, guys. No way. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, guys. Really disappointed. They're disappointed. That's just so disappointing. This is such a special night for so many developers. It's really disappointing to see someone uh, act that way. But we're going to wow. move on with the show. We've got a lot of great games. Someone rushed the stage again. That last guy, so the the real sad. rabbi Bill Clinton like caused that, dude. Games. Now everyone's going to do shit like that. Us. So without further ado, um, that I sucks. want to right on with the show because we've got a lot to show you. And that fucking games, sucks. Tom, this guy is actually yeah, blind? I thought he was cosplaying or something. None of those apply to you. They, they might He's not a poser? They might be useful tools for you regardless. So no way. That is so sick. Are you kidding me? If this other guy loses, we are going to talk so much shit to him, dude. He's asking you for the song named Bannable? Only if it's for this fucking song. How do you not know the Guile theme? Are you kidding? What a fucking scrub. How are you going to ask for the song name for the Guile theme song, dude? You have never made a comeback in your entire life, and you never will. <laughs> Cannot make a comeback. It can't be done. Oh, no. Come back. He's still burned out. Jesus Christ! You gotta be fucking kidding me! Oh! Oh! Plus $20,000! Oh, wait. There might be stuff in this, these barrels and shit. Shabby doors. Oh, fuck. Huh? What the? <clears throat> what the hell did you do? Holy moly. Hey, thanks, Zlobin, on my... Last name or first name? One of the devs of this game was named Zlobin. <laughs> Man, I like it when they're creative. Hey, thanks, Zlobin. Stupid bitch. This fucking cheap-ass joke-making bitch only donated a dollar for that. <laughs> we have a very high bar for humor around here, okay? Highly sophisticated. Myself and the chat room. So, we won't just laugh at any stupid shit like Ivana Jerk Menov. <laughs> you know? Man, I love that. When you think about dinner and your mouth waters, I love that. Isn't that cool? It's like a boner, but in your mouth. Isn't that crazy? It's like a response, an actual physical response to a thought. Not a boner in your mouth, like a mouth equivalent <laughs> of a boner. Thank you. You guys, uh, you really are, uh, what's the word we like to use? Bloodthirsty homosexuals. That's what it is. Uh, definitely. That is how I would describe my fan base. Persian sour prunes. Holy shit. Ah! Fuck! Fuck! 
fucking bitch, snake. What? Ah! Fucking stab it. All right, dude. Get the gun. Fuck you, you little sneaky bitch. <sighs> Thank you. Poof. Oh my god, you gotta be fucking kidding me! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Yes! I can't believe I got this is the third one! The song! My nipples right now! Woo! Oh, this guy again. <laughs> Woo! Oh, this guy again. Woo! I'm gonna go all the way up. Okay. Now. You think he's... Huh? <laughs> I'm gonna get up and stretch and take a little whiz. Hide her clothes before you go on break? Someone shoot this orange pervert. How do I do that? Oh, shit. National Weather Service Emergency Alert in your area. Man, whatever, dude. I'm not reading all this shit. This is dangerous and life-threatening. Sweeping face, dude. Whatever, man. I got shit to do. <laughs> oh, right back at you, right? So she's damaged, but works both ways. Oh, no. That was a while. I haven't seen that kind of mix in a while. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, try the sexy straps on Evil Eris. All right. We got to try the sexy straps on Evil Eris. Huh. Nah. <laughs> yeah, I'm telling you, when I worked at the library, I wish I was kidding. There were multiple jackers that we had to call the police on that would do exactly that. They would put a jacket on their fucking dick and jack off and do Korean backdashes. And we had to call the cops on them. And now that these Korean players are popularizing that whole jacket jerk off strat i think okay. that we're gonna have to start watching out for public jerkers at tournaments you know think about it dude it's the perfect scheme they could just jerk off in public and no one will suspect them female dwarfs have beards i understand that but do they have dicks that's what i'm asking this guy doesn't listen dude hey you don't listen huh I can see they have fucking beards. No dicks. Boring. Kazumi. So now the Kazumi comes out when he's one game away from elimination. Wow. Unprecedented right, levels go. of boredom. Yo, man, Am I gonna have to bring out the lightning again? There's no way I'm gonna let you sleep and I'm gonna sit here and drive this whole way. We gotta take turns. We gotta do like the night shift. Right now it's my turn to sleep. You gotta wake up, all right? You slept during that last match. Lightning! Wake up! Lightning! It's my turn to sleep. Lightning! And you know both of them want to run back. Oh, both of them do. I'm sick of this shit. You're always sleeping. both of these guys down here. It's my turn. Just wake me up when it's when I, you know. We'll do a rotation, bros. What? <laughs> we. We we had taken Uh oh. Get out! Get out! Get out! 
Get These two here. are stooges, dude. Look, if I needed glasses, <laughs> thank you. I would get glasses. I'm not doing. This isn't like. Ah! It's going down. You could check that out if you like that. Sorry to disappoint, but disappointment is a part of life. <laughs> I think you're supposed to move or else that thing will crush you. <laughs> I suspect that if you are a big fan of 90s X-Files and sci-fi and aliens, that type of alien, which I am, then you won't like anime. Because anime, they took those big head, big eyed, small mouth aliens and they just put a wig on them and some makeup and some big giant titties and call them waifus. Wow, what a weird way to end missions. Damn, this game is boring as fuck, dude. This game's boring as fuck. Did you see how crazy it was when that mission ended? Every mission ends that way. Like super anticlimactic, just fades away. And then shows you this blue screen, no music. Weird. Go here and destroy this generator. Mission done. No, there was a boss. It was epic. Didn't you see the boss? It was epic. Remember, bro, bros? It was a boss. Epic boss. And now there's this iconic cutscene. Someone earlier said that people are playing Armored Core but with a frown on and saying they love it. Is that really true? Let's see who's playing it. Armored Core. I enjoy this game very much. <laughs> How Oh, he was about to say however! Oh! Arsenal won like his 40th world championship and at the end he's like, Now, you finally can't say that this was a fluke. And I'm thinking to myself, man, this guy is rolling around at night having nightmares because of the chat room. Just telling him it's a fluke. He thinks that you think it really is a fluke. That's fucked up, man. We're just saying that shit because it's fucking funny, dude. You guys, like, never lose. How could it be a fluke? While on the other hand, they're like, we really need to prove it to them. I need to prove that I, this isn't a fluke. I gotta win again. I need to win 10 Evos. This'll show the chat that it's not a fluke. Every character in every Final Fantasy is extremely unique, except... In this one, you can meet 15 characters and they all look alike. Game sucks, dude. FF16 has no soul and the story is convoluted. The dialogue is so goddamn dramatic and fake. Shut up, bitch! Nobody gives a fuck! That game is tight! And you don't know shit! This guy's taste sucks! It's the best Final Fantasy game there's ever been. Shut the fuck up, Ebert and Roper. Nobody gives a shit about your opinion. You see what I'm saying? Are you following along with how much fun this is compared to playing Armored Core? You see what I mean? Anyway, action. Fuck you, you stupid bitch. Keep your shit-eating opinion on the front page. All I remember is that she was really pretty and I shook her hand and as I was shaking it I realized that she has no thumb and you need thumbs so that there's an end to the handshake right so when I went in to shake her hand and she had no thumb I had no like there were no there was no breaks so it was like oh shit and I realized there's no thumb here there was no handshake collision so I went like, oh, and then I was like, dang, you don't have a thumb. Thank you. <laughs> look at this, look at this fucking thing he's playing on, dude. 
You got to put it in your ass to uh, use it correctly? What is this thing? <laughs> Thank you. You got to sit on that thing, and then it activates full control of your character. Oh, shit. DualSense controller disconnected? It's okay. Let's not panic. Controller. Oh, did his controller just die? Oh no, not like this. Is he re he's like, <laughs> thank you. What are we doing? We're gonna continue. They're playing. They I'm just played it out. That's a throwback. Our icon turn. That's cool. Let's move forward. I like it. I like it. If it were me, I would have taken the round. Ooh. Hey, why don't you get a controller that works, bitch? So I would have taken that round so fucking fast, dude, without even hesitating. Give me the fucking round. Better hit hit up fucking Quambo over there and get something that works, scrub. I'm telling you right now, I'm not even fucking kidding. kidding. I've done it before, and I would do it again. If you really break it down and think about it, the good old days, while they were happening, they fucking sucked. They were terrible. But now when you look back at them, they were good old days. So what does that mean? That means that no matter what, today is going to be the good old days. Right now is the good old days. No matter how shitty it is, when you get old, that becomes the good old days. So you got to be like appreciative of right now. Because right now is the good old days of the future. And you could be dead then you know what i mean you don't know what i mean you are a dumb bitch you don't know what anything means you don't know what stoic means you don't know anything you're not playing cyberpunk wow man people do that so much yesterday i was playing diablo and they'd come in and say you're not playing lies of p like what are you not a fucking eye user it's pretty fucking obvious to anyone who's not a f worthless shithead bitch that I'm obviously not playing what I'm not playing, and I am playing what I am playing. Stupid fuckers, dude. How do you even <laughs> exist? Who put your pants on for you this morning? Try being an observer. You know? Stupid ass fucking questions, dude. How about hello? You ever think of that for a greeting? Not playing Cyberpunk? Not playing Wise of P? Fuck you, man. Anyway, I hope you're having a good day. Final Fantasy 16 is getting two DLCs. Is Final Fantasy 16 getting two DLCs before or after Final Fantasy 7 Remake gets completed? Dude. Video games fucking suck, dude. Thirty-eight looks whack. I don't like that boxed in face. It's like you're in prison. In a hair prison, dude. <laughs> Thank you. All of you are in a hair prison, man. You need to be set free like me. <laughs> I like the way he moves. Oh my god. Holy shit. Is that an overhead? The first button I always push in Moron Combat is down three. <laughs> what on earth is this? It's a low? That's a low? That's a low. That shit hits him in his nipples. Look how high my leg goes. That's a low. So he's like stepping on your foot. That's like a foot stomp. What a down three. What a down three. You can count on these guys. What about, oh! <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> oh, shit. Down four. Whoa, sweet. Oh! <laughs> Fucking the penguin. <laughs> Just ye and yeah? How do they get away with this shit, dude? This is a tragedy. <laughs> What did he used to say? Is there like a YouTube video of this guy? Well, what do you Google if you want to hear what Raiden says? Uh, what Raiden says <laughs> in 
Mortal Kombat. Uh, what is this? Raiden. Oh my god. <laughs> Dude! Oh my god. <laughs> what does perfect guard have to do with this? Like, I could perfect guard a bullet? What the fuck?! <laughs> Like, man, that is a weird sound for a parry. The weirdest parry sound I've ever heard. <laughs> what the fuck? This game's tough. Hey, over here. Okay. Find the key. Oh, my God. <laughs> Like Indiana Jones, dude. Jesus. Uh oh. Put rules in the chat if you don't want questions. Are you crazy, dude? The rules are unwritten so that I can catch little cocksuckers like you who think that they can say stupid shit in here. I understand you're used to other streams where people put rules and shit, but I don't have to do that. If I don't put the rules, what it does is it allows me to reveal who's a little bitch. You see how well it worked on you? I would have never known you were a bitch if I had listed the rules there. So thankfully, this is a clear reason why I don't put rules up. It works like a charm. It reveals who's a fucking demanding cocksucker who thinks that they can do whatever the fuck they want. This is the same as those dumbasses who say shit like, freedom of speech, bro. You don't understand the first thing about freedom of speech. You could do or say what you want, but it doesn't mean you will not get fucked up for it. Okay? Uh, I want to join the Freestar Ranger. Fit for you. The Rangers can do a lot of good. <laughs> <laughs> I need to know you can handle it now. You helped out with the situation. Oh man, this game's tight. Who was that guy? Use the mission this game's tight. A hundred cops to catch one fucking asshole armed with a dog. <laughs> hundred thousand dollars of taxpayer money. This guy was armed, he was driving top speed in a golf cart and armed with a dog. This is one for the books for both Susie and I who have covered many pursuits here on KCAL News. Extended magazine. They arrested the dog? <laughs> Get down. That's his throw, back throw. What? Oh my god, that is so tight. Why did that happen though? I didn't call a cameo. Is that just a... Re Oh my god, that is so tight. That is so tight. Oh, I... was that a siren too? Dude, as he's coming in, you can see red and blue lights on his shoulder. Did you see that? Oh my. Ooh, pull over to the right, please. Extra object under the table and. The... Ah! There was no extra object under the table before I fucking catch this intruder. Nice fucking extra object under the table in the living room, you moron. Whoa.
It's not behind her head like the first key. It's not between her titties like the second key. Oh my god. You're it's not there, dude. You can see it's not there. Oh well, better make sure. <laughs> Get the fuck. Oh wait, I heard it. I heard it. Oh boy. I think I see it. <laughs> I could see that. Iconic. Have I improved, Lord <coughs> Oh my god, dude. You really gonna. It's a fucking casual match, dude. Man. It's a fucking. We're in casual mode, dude. You don't have to. Quit mid fucking match, dude. Man, this experience overall, I must say, is sub fun. <laughs> Thank you. Sub fun. Uh, thanks, Kobe Yellow. No, the hell? <laughs> Thank you. Twitch. Wake up! This guy's name is Moist Boy Hole. And Twitch is like, no problem. Come on in. They banned DJ Busta Nut, by the way. You're banned. You can't have that. Moist Boy Hole, you're welcome in. Come on in. You better not fucking... I better not see you in here again with that name. Do you understand me? Keep that fucking name out of here. Do you understand? I'm, I'll ban you. I'm telling you. <clears throat> yeah, ban that dude. You can't play against wired opponents, so you can't block out Wi-Fi. If you do get a wired opponent, you also can't win. You can lose. Fine. That's no problem. But if you win... You can't do that. So you're back to searching through Wi-Fi opponents. Winning is frowned upon. Oh. Well, I can tell you that this whole experience so far, this game is really fun and I want to keep playing it, but the online experience is... Even if Street Fighter hadn't recently come out, I would say this is a subpar by today's standard experience. But with Street Fighter coming out and it being as good as it was, this game's about to look for a new opponent. <laughs> no, that doesn't look different. Look. Ah! Fuck! Hey, there's a ghost in here, damn it! I ate half of it yesterday, all right? I ate half of it yesterday and I was like, I'm gonna eat the rest of this tomorrow for lunch. Then I went to bed and I had a dream about eating lamb kebab. They were that good. I had a dream about eating lamb kebab. Then when I woke up in the morning, hype as fuck to eat the lamb kebabs, I went to the fridge and they were eaten. So it's, I think that that was not a dream. Doors are open in the hallway. Entrance, toilet. Ah! Fat bitch! There's a lot of fat chicks in this town. <laughs> Have you noticed? Pretty cool. Uh, thanks, strike villain. <coughs> I mean, the whole place is a food court so far. Oh, it's San Antonio? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I actually did hear that. San Antonio is like the fattest place in the US and the US is like the fattest place on earth. So that's like pretty impressive. Man, I had to take a shit so bad. There was no place open in the entire mall except for the fucking gym. 
So I walked in there and I was like, oh, I'm really interested. Look at me, I'm fat. I'm really interested in the gym, but I gotta take a shit. Can I use your restroom? Oh yeah, it's over there past the locker. I'm going in there and I might as well have just dropped my shit in my pants. This guy had the tiniest dick. And he was like, like Captain Morganing on the bench, just like chilling. I was like, oh man. I didn't know I, I didn't know this was gonna be part of the deal. I got bait. It was some Miyazaki shit, dude. I'm gonna check anyway. Man, I'm looking. Ho! Oh, there's a fat guy taking a shit in this bathroom. What the hell? I don't need a closer. All right, this game's tight. I will agree with that. You got me, Dev. Yes! No! The second he hit us! Isn't that the Tell voice him, actor from Deus Ex? Why are you tagging me in some you stupid shit now. like that? Are you the voice actor from Deus Ex and trying to get some attention? Who gives a fuck? You know, are you trying to, uh, that guy is trying to get some attention or some shit? Hey guys, doesn't this sound like the voice actor from Deus Ex? Log into another account. Yeah, actually, amigo, it does. I love his work in Human Revolution, right? Shut up, bitch. No one gives a fuck about that weak bitch. Bunny outfit. Hey, would you stay focused? The bunny outfit, I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> what was I saying? Some folks from the Shaw gang tried to rob the place, but they got spotted by a gun. This did not happen last time. Off. Something occurred yeah, last man. time that pissed him off. Are they pissed at... This game is so sick. This is exactly what I was hoping for. Some folks from the Shaw gang, they took everyone inside hostage. They're using the intercom to communicate. See? Drop your weapons down. Yes. What? It's a big group, but eyes outside is the in run smuggling job off world. They take in all kinds. Rookies and veterans alike. <laughs> oh, Todd! This game is so sick, dude. This game is so sick. I don't know what the hell's going on, but this this is my favorite quest so far. Hey, give me my reward. I heard the fight. The hostages. Are they safe? Oh! Dude! Uh, yes. That's, that's good to hear. Those people aren't just citizens of the Free Star Collective. They're like family. <laughs> As for the Shaw gang... <laughs> Do I smell or something? Them too. Here, you've more than earned this. He's giving me a reward. A oh, wow. God, my robot... Would you... My robots... What are you good for? This worthless kill him. I'm up on the roof. Um, who the? Whoa! Did you see that the Mexican government found an alien? <laughs> Shut up, bitch.